Good morning, my name is Jacob Folger. I'm an artist sculptor and today I'm going to show you how to make a lion. I'm just going to do the face of course and um, and it's going to be roughed in for just uh, demonstration purposes. I've taken a ball of clay, shaped it to a little bit of like a cone shape and now I've made indentations for where the eyes would go. I'm going to take a, a little piece of clay and roll it into a ball and then to a noodle like that. I'm going to lay it on top here between the eyes and going down and this is going to be the bridge of the nose. I'm going to flatten it a little bit. And then just sort of terminate it there like that. This is a sculpting technique that I teach. It's called simple shapes and it's basically just uh, forming simple shapes out of clay and assembling them to form figures and caricatures. <clears throat> I'm taking two balls of clay now and putting down here at the bottom for the whisker area of the lion. You see I'm mostly using my hands. I do have some tools here and I'm going to use a little bit of that in a few minutes but mostly I'm using my hands because they work really good and they're great tools and I'm very used to using them. I'm going to take a little bit of clay for the bottom jaw and add it right here. He's coming around real nice actually I think. Now I'm going to take one of my tools and I'm going to make an indentation to uh, create the eye socket for the eyes. And then I'm going to take a little ball of clay like this and put it in there for the eyeball. I'm going to repeat that for the other eye. Okay, now I'm going to take this wood tool, this wood sculpting tool here, and I'm going to put a line on the line, uh, kind of an indentation on the eyeball for the pupil of the eye. See, if I didn't do that, it would look like he's blind. If he has pupils, then he has uh, sight. And so there's two pupils. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little noodle of clay, like this. I'm going to lay it on top there. And that's going to be his eyelid. I'm going to do the uh, same on the other side. You can see how quickly it comes together. Now I'm going to blend that in at the top just to join it to the head. Now I'm going to create a little more depth in the forehead with a little bit more of kind of uh, some work on the eye here. I'm just going to add a little uh, bit of an eyebrow at the top there. Just uh, little noodles of clay I'm adding basically to do that. He looks pretty serious, huh? <laughs> okay, he's a lion. Lions can look serious. Okay, so then uh, I'm going to roll a couple little balls and put on uh, his ears in the back here. I'm gonna look like that. I'm 
the one here. Just press those into place. And then I can take the sculpting tool and just blend in the ear to the head. And I can also press into it to create kind of a little cubby hole in the uh, in the ear, like that. Almost there now. So take a little bit of clay here and just put it in here, just a tuft of it. That's going to be for uh, his the beginning of his mane. And then we just add clay around the outside for um, his mane coming down. So, a couple things about sculpting clay is, if you tried to make this lion, I'd be willing to bet if you slowed down this video and you watched it, you would be able to make this lion. It would be a little rough, and the reason why is because you've not practiced. If you practiced and made a couple lions, the third lion you made would be far better than the first lion. And the reason why is because you would be more practiced. Your hands would be more used to doing the sculpture. So, it's basically that simple. I'm just going to add a little bit more clay there. And uh, you can take a tool like this and just uh, carve in lines to uh, make it look like hair. My channel is on YouTube and um, I have uh, many, many videos on doing all kinds of clay sculpture where you can uh, take your time and learn I'm an easygoing guy, so it's it's easy to uh, to take my classes and watch my classes because I'm you know I'm uh, pretty easygoing and people seem to like that. And that's basically how you roughen a lion. And I just wanted to demonstrate that for you. So uh, please come to my YouTube channel. Uh, my name is again is Jacob Holger um, and. Um, and check it out. And uh, thanks for watching and have a great day.